wanna show to the world that you're the bad one. You always be bad. That you're all my love, you're all my time, you're all my heart. You begged me to come away with you, 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 you. I don't know, I'm fine without you. I even had to remove my shoes, my feet were dying. I could not do it. I could not. So, and I think my makeup is going off. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm right. I'm gonna start I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Guys, apparently, yeah. apparently, Zim guys, according to Boyd, Zim guys don't they cheat. Don't. What do you say? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. You guys, you guys know this from my channel. Whoa, <laughs> run! <laughs> So the house is still a mess because of the painting and the fact that the paint was still getting dry. Like we have to move the furniture back. And like it's a bit gloomy today, so I probably look a little pale. But I am about to head off. I am going to Rose Bank to shoot and film a podcast that you guys will be hearing about very soon. So yeah. I just want to say good morning and hi and I do hope that you're well so yeah um this is me let me get going because I don't want to be late so I'll see you guys when I get there I'll probably try and get a little bit of like footage while I'm there so let's get going done it I done this before you fly I won't catch you don't know I'm stolen because you love to have a more crying Gonna be sweet, tell me you need me. But I'm from a city that's size cool. I give them the cinema, I go. Cause you are bad money, she don't love money, she break. Good morning. Um, uh, it's Monday. It is busy day of the week, errand day, um, emails, and a lot of other stuff. I have a lot of emails that I have to respond to and I just have a few things that I have to do outside before I do that. So I am planning to try be out of the house for at least two hours and then I should be back. So this is my outfit. I'm just wearing black pants, this black top from Zara. Obviously we're gonna wear a black mask and then I'm carrying this um, Bag just to add a pop of spring somehow whatever you call it I'm sorry the washing machine is making some noise but we also have to do the laundry today so this is how I look usually when I'm running errands and I don't want to be late I literally just pick out a black outfit is the quickest thing to um, sort of like pick out so, 
so I have like a new journal it says over there I am remarkable um it's from an event that I attended the other day on Twitter space and yeah so just to make sure that I literally stay outside for two hours I have written down a list of the things that need that need to be done today um, obviously I know what needs to be done for the whole week that I've spaced everything out so I'm not gonna try to do too much in one day and not be able to answer my emails so I'm gonna leave right now leave right now I've put on sunscreen I, th I hope I put enough we still have a bit of um, the marks here that need to go away this is all these are like the marks that i left over from my acne and on this side so yeah put on sunscreen to make sure that those don't get any worse or get darker like literally guys if you don't apply sunscreen the spots that you already have on your skin can get darker i'm just letting you know so and that machine is competing with me so i'm gonna go Hi guys, so I came back from the store a while ago and I got so immersed in work that I forgot to show you guys what I had actually gone to get. So, first thing, I got this vase over oh, here. Yeah. yeah, how pretty that is. Got this vase, it's actually 329 from H&M this is for my other pompous grass I'm gonna place in here and then while I was there I also saw this nice serving marble dish so I think I am gonna use this to shoot some of my drinks content over here so absolutely love this this was a 3.99 so these are stuff that i got and now i'm gonna figure out what to eat um tina's not here she's in europe enjoying the european heat there because she said it's hot today i checked up on her she actually thought it would be raining and it wasn't raining it's been hot so because i'm alone I think I'm just gonna order in. I'm really not in the mood to cook. I did make something to eat for lunch, but that was it. And guys, how stunning are the walls? I know I said I'd show you guys the house, but like, the thing is, like the people that did our place were so rude. Like, I don't know why, I'm, I'm not trying to say it's all people, but I feel like every time when we worked with black people, they're very friendly and then like some white people just tend to be very rude like this guy was so rude that i will not say the company that did the painting because i don't think they deserve that like free pr so yeah the house is like extremely white now like white that the couch looks dirty that's how white it is that the couch itself doesn't look clean but Anyways, and then I also just got some got to be glue so I could spray the pompous um, because yeah, it's like flaking a little bit. So I'm gonna do that. And yeah, I was wearing. I did show you guys what I was wearing. So let me figure out something to eat. I feel like I've I've got a headache. I think I need to drink some water. Yeah, chat later good morning guys i hope you're well so i just washed my face um one thing that i like to do immediately these days when i wake up is i wash my face because i wake up with it completely dry i don't know if this mic is facing me like i think the um, holding thing broke so the first thing i like to do with my face is um that is like my mini setup of my office you can see my printer my laptop i've been working there while tina is away because we have not done anything to the office and i don't really like work that long so i work there for a bit and then i pack it up later in the evening so and now i want oh i was talking about my face so i wash my face and i usually apply some hyaluronic acid um like cream and then thereafter i spray it with the face mask so one thing 
if you're going to use hyaluronic acid because it's supposed to draw liquids into your skin and keep it more hydrated i would recommend that you spray a face mist over it so that like it works even better i have my morning voice um so i just want to go online right now post uh post i got fresh corners yesterday i'm supposed to do two wig reviews this week and then i have two more coming in um and then i think after that i'm gonna take a break from wig reviews and like probably do like braids or something um so now i want to write my to-do list one thing that i feel like has literally been making a working so much better um is waking up and writing my to-do list so i want to write down my to-do list and then i just need to oh there was something important i needed to do now you see this is why it's important to have a to-do list um so y'all guys i just wanted to keep you updated and say good morning and then i hope you're good i mean it's actually so nice being by myself this week ah it is so nice but yeah I need something for my lips guys one thing i'm gonna miss <laughs> one thing i'm gonna miss about being on artane is how my lips okay i had small lips if you watch my old videos you will know that like my upper lip is very small so when i talk it obviously used to look weird and for the longest time i've always said i want to get my upper lip injected a bit so that it can literally be symmetrical to like like the bottom one but not like too symmetrical like almost like complement my bottom lip my bottom lip is bigger than my top lip so when i when i talk it's always been a little weird but now that i'm on artane it's like it made them a little juicier if i can say <laughs> so when i get off that i'm gonna miss that um so yeah i'm just gonna get to working guys and i will update you later after um, I've done my week review. Maybe I'll put you guys somewhere so you can see me film a little bit and then yeah See you later. Hey loves. Um, so obviously From the last time we spoke in the morning. I've filmed now. I unfortunately don't like place you somewhere I didn't realize that this battery was gonna die. It died You guys didn't even get to see how nice my lips looked. I just ate now. So everything is gone but i love i love how the finish came out today looks really good so i'm about to go to the shops and yeah besides this is a little spot where i was like doing my hair that's what i'm wearing i think i need to get a mirror for this room because it has more light like it makes so much sense having the mirror in here because of the light so i think i'll bring the mirror in here some days good morning guys okay uh it's the next day i had to sleep in my wig because i literally got um approval from a campaign that i'm supposed to be working on with a new client i'm so happy to be getting work i'm like so grateful because in the current climate that we're in in south africa like just having work and a stable income is something that we should be all grateful for so i'm really grateful for that and i'm and i'm grateful for your guys support because like without you i always think like without you guys watching my content or like liking or sharing or commenting like i wouldn't be where i am i wouldn't be able to charge the amount of money that i charge brands they wouldn't see the value in me so you know i was just thinking about how grateful i am right now in this moment and i was just like talking to an old friend and we're speaking about just like how far i've come and he was just letting me know like how he's like literally always just checking up on me and watching and like guys when i think about it like we just always need to be grateful so right now i know so many people out there don't have what i have and i'm grateful for everything i'm grateful for the roof over my head i know i woke up i wake up so early because we painted the house and since we painted we have not had well i haven't had time to go look for the curtains because currently my sister's not even in the country so she really can't help me 
and I was supposed to do that this week. I was supposed to look for new curtain rails. If we can't find new curtain rails, we're going to have to like put the old ones back. Thank goodness we didn't get rid of them. We just held on to them for a while. So it's kind of like every morning I'm woken up extra early. So like about five, um, five. Actually, I'm not even sleeping in my room because in my room I face the neighbors. So I was like freaking out, like I can't sleep in there. And then they wake up watching me while I sleep. Like literally, their balconies face mine. So <clears throat> since Tina's not in the country, I've been using her room, and the sun shines in there as soon as the sun rises i can feel it on my face i can feel it in my eyes so i've been waking up extra early but i'm so grateful because then i've actually worked a little hard at this week i've accomplished more just from being able to wake up early and i think that's something i'm gonna like go take forward like i don't think i want to sleep in the dark because i feel like that makes me sleep longer so even if we do get curtains i do think i might sleep with just the lace and because people can't really see with the lace like so that that light wakes me up and you know i'm more energized i feel like i have more energy when i wake up in the light than i do when i wake up in the dark I've been talking for so long but yeah guys so right now I'm just so grateful like when I look at the amount of um, work and opportunities that have been coming into my life I'm just so grateful um, and I know it's because I've been praying and I've been decreeing and I've been working hard towards those things like I wouldn't be where I am if I wasn't helping myself also at the same time so I'm just proud of myself and I feel like I wanted to like share this with you because you need to be proud of where you are now like just take a moment to think back like like in this moment this is something that you used to pray about before and finally like you have it I used to pray to have my own home and sit in it and be somebody i used to pray to like there's like something great that's coming also for last week baby i prayed for this moment and it's about to happen so just like take a moment and think back on your life like where you've been and where you are now and like let's just give thanks like if you could if you guys could share that in the comment section if you don't mind if you're brave enough to share like you know things that you've overcome and where you are now i think that would be great that would motivate someone besides myself talking so i'm gonna stop uh blabbing because we're about to hit the five minute mark so i will see you guys later when my makeup is done and i'll film the content for client i'm so excited to be filming this um i don't know why but like the past few days i've just been feeling so much better emotionally and um I think I kind of know why, but that's something I'll share la later in a later stage. But I'm so grateful that I've taken this step and like, yeah. So, thank you guys. Thanks for listening. It's always great to know that someone's listening. You know, it's like a little therapy session, me and you. Okay, chat later. So I'm put on my mask. It is so hot outside. It's nice and hot. Like, we, we missed... We missed summer but very hot don't forget to put your sunscreen i put sunscreen on like so much um thank goodness my moisturizer has sunscreen and i still put moisturizer like sunscreen on top so let me go inside just double check if i have everything my wallet my phone um the car keys guys if you're looking for these jars they have them at West Clear, uh, West Pack Lifestyle, all different sizes. guys i just bought something similar at westpac this is 2.79 it was 70 rand next door <laughs> i could never no ways ha huh.
guys can you see where i am i am at the take a lot warehouse oh my god i'm so excited um you guys are the first to find out besides my family you're the first to find out that i am now in a financial position to start upscaling my business so we are growing lashmi baby and lashmi baby is going to be on take a lot and thereafter um i am going to start also distributing through other channels so look out for that very soon um So literally I'm here dropping off the parcel um, with some lashes. They only wanted a few just to make sure that I'm able to deliver. I'm obviously at the Jobic DC and I wanted to come myself to see where it is. I want to know where my stuff is going to be, you know. Um, um, the first... So the Cape Town one, that's been shipped. And then this one I'm dropping off myself because I like to be involved in my business. I think it's an exciting um, step in my journey and I just wanted to like literally be a part of it. So I'm so excited, guys. Guys, you'll be able to shop my lashes on Take A Lot. So for those of you who complain about shipping prices, you guys can check out with all your stuff on Take A Lot. You can use your, you can use your e-bucks to shop. Yeah, so as I was saying, you can shop with eBucks, guys. You can literally pay on delivery now. Uh, well, as soon as it goes live, I hope everything goes well. Um, obviously, in Jesus' name, everything will go well because we believe in this family. So let me just go drop this off and then I'll keep you guys updated. So later. Hey, guys. So here is my stock that is going to take a lot. Um, obviously I did ship my first few orders just to like test run the process and I wanted to see where the Jobic DC was and now these two are going to Cape Town and these two are going to Joburg with a whole lot more stock. All the lashes will be um, on the website so do order them like for now give the website a break. <laughs> and order from take a lot i'd really appreciate it because you guys have an opportunity to actually even go back like take a lot reminds you to sort of like review the products i'd really appreciate that if you did but wow i'm so excited for this new journey i'm so so excited I was, I was listening to boys. <laughs> wow. wow, I'm the only one again, yet again. Hi. 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 Guys, so I got my wig laid today and it looks so good. I feel like it's the season for bobs and everyone should have a bob. So you guys, if you've missed the video, it's probably on my channel up already on how I got this wig laid and what it looked like before. It's, you know, it wasn't giving. I had no hope. I seriously had no hope in this hair, but it looks so good. It looks so good. And I just finished doing my makeup right now uh, for a live webinar that I'll be on on actually how you can turn your side hustle into like a profitable business. So if you guys missed that, I'll definitely like try to find the link and leave it down below. But I don't know how much of this vlog I've actually vlogged. It's been a wishy-washy vlog where I've been up and down. But I really, really told myself that this October I am going to try and do Vlogtober. Literally, I'm going to try do that. 
so it might be like five minute ten minute vlogs but i will give you what i can and definitely that's what i can promise so i'm so excited for vlog time and this hair looks so bomb wow no i'm i'm obsessed this is hot i love it i love it i love it morning guys oh guys i started feeling so shit like yesterday after um, i did the momentum um webinar like i got off that call and literally my body just i don't know it's like my body was just hanging on till i could do that and i had such a bad <coughs> bad like like my body was just so sore like it's still sore and um i just feel so shit and i've been coughing a little bit i feel like it's the change of season and the fact that i've been working so much so i'm not sure but now i am at the dermatologist's office today is my last um well, I'm hoping it's my last appointment with Well, it's not like officially like last. If things ever go wrong, I'll be back here. But today, I'm going to see her for the face. And, you know, I've done this video. Like, I've done this so many times where I vlog in the car when I'm outside her office. And honestly, I don't think the past when I looked at that, like, it compares to where my skin is at now. So I'm really excited and this time I'm hoping for the best. Hopefully no additional three months because we don't have a single pimple. Not one and we haven't had one in some months now. Um, the only thing that I had is a bit of a heat rash. Like you see I can, I'm struggling to like talk a bit. <clears throat> so the only thing I've been dealing with is a bit of like um, heat rash from driving the other day because i'm so not used to driving outside but yeah so i'll let you guys know what happens when i come outside when i come out of there and my appointment's at one in nine minutes so i'm on time and i need to get home and film some stuff for momentum because i was actually meant to film it yesterday right after the the live the zoom call but the lady that came to do my nails arrived on time so i couldn't so and i thought i'd do it later in the evening and then i had a headache i just was not in the highest of spirits i don't want to be high spirits on the zoom call and then you guys go watch the videos and i look like crap okay so hopefully this goes well because i need to go home and do my makeup and yeah and i think i need to pick up um this thing from nay before i go home to use it to lay my edges yeah so i'll see you guys now now in like 20 minutes never takes long anyway in her office so let me get in there hey guys so i did get home on time and i did my makeup i literally just filmed those two videos i'm trying to edit them now <coughs> i'm trying to edit them now my laptop just died and it won't go on i don't know why so i'm just waiting for it to charge a bit maybe it'll go on i did flash battery low so i'm just hoping it's that because um my deadline is for four okay it's gone on my deadline is for 4 p.m and it's 15 28 i've edited the one the other one is literally also going to take me five minutes since i've already found the music and stuff but yeah yes, yes i look very pretty for a girl that's dying <coughs> in her field so like i'm still deciding if i really want to do vlogtober i don't know if i have the energy for it you know um 
but i think i'll try it's just vlogging every day you guys will just have to see how bored i am every day if that's the case and what i get up to so um, i'll chat to you later guys i love how dark my room is now like i've been sleeping and i didn't realize it was 11 but i think that's also because i'm sick um so yeah i got these curtains from um what you call that place i went there the other day my bed's a mess oh um oriental plaza so that's where i went so now because I finally know my results. I thought I was sick, guys. I thought I had COVID. That's how bad it was. I went to go get tested yesterday. And I just got my results. Well, Tina came and woke me up and she's like, did you get your results? And then I checked my phone. I had an SMS and it says, I'm not detected. So I'm okay. Um, but I had like a fever and I was coughing. And sometimes like, you know, the other day when I was trying to record content, I really couldn't speak like three sentences without taking a break to breathe. I just didn't understand why. It's like a really, like the coughing started before I had like the actual issues with like the flu, or like my nose. So that like, I was already panicking, like where could I have picked this up? You know, I've been so, so careful and I've dodged this thing for almost a year, like over a year. And on top of that, we're supposed to go get our final vaccine shot next week. I was so excited about that. So, yeah, guys, I do not have COVID. Yay. Okay, so I'm going to just end off this vlog. Yeah, I really wanted to do vlog tools, but I'm not so sure I will anymore since I'm so sick. But I will see. Maybe I'll do it every couple of days. I'll try but I'm going to feel sick. I can't do this to myself. So yeah guys. Um I hope you're enjoying October. Who's partaking in October? If you're partaking in October, comment down below because I think I am on that train. Tina, are you still taking part in October? Sorry? Are you still gonna take part in October? Yeah. Okay, um so oh, wait, no, your birthday's in two months. <laughs> Joby, I think you must just carry on until your birthday. No, I'm not in December. Oh, wow. Joby, just do it. I said it. Since when? It's been a week now. Mm -hmm. So, we're on the 2nd of October. On the 30th of November, I'm just here. Ah, Kelly, okay. just do it. Just do it till oh, before your birthday. Oh, oh. Show, me, show me you can That's do it. It's December, they made us drink water. You never know the girls again will drink water. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so Tina is not about that life, but I'll take it for as long as I can. And you know, um, I'd love you guys to also join us and do it for as long as you can. So, till my next vlog, guys, much love. <laughs>